Are you afraid to fail? Do you replay every quote-unquote failure in your mind over and over again until it drives you mad? Well, you're probably failing wrong. So let's get into it. All right, guys, let's talk about failure. All right, nobody wants to talk about that. Everybody wants to talk about how successful they are and how much money they got and the great crib and the Lambo and all that stuff. But nobody ever talks about the failures they've encountered um, along the way. Well, today we're talking about failure. And the uh, impetus for this uh, episode of the podcast uh, was from a book called The Maxwell Daily Reader. It's um, a collection of short, uh, I guess, essays um, from John C. Maxwell. John C. Maxwell is a leadership uh, expert. So every morning, this is one of the things I I read, uh, this um, Maxwell Daily Reader. And, uh, you know, it comes up, uh, it has some really good stuff in there. Some things that, that I can really ponder on and think about and implement uh, into not just my business, but also um, into my life. And I think people don't know how to lose anymore. And I don't want to get on this whole, you know, uh, everybody gets a trophy, you know, society that we're, we're uh, in right now. But, you know, I hear a lot of people you know, you like to use that phrase, oh, I never lose. I either win or I learn, which, I mean, it's kind of lame, but I understand kind of what they're saying, but you also have to acknowledge that you lost or that you failed, right? Embrace those failures. Failure is is the only way you're going to eventually succeed. Every millionaire, every billionaire, Super Bowl champion, NBA champion, whatever. They've all failed at some point. The only way you can never fail is if you never try. And believe me, I have uh, <laughs> I failed uh, a lot in my life. I failed a lot in business. I've um, succeeded, though, as well. So don't get me wrong. I'm not just uh, some chronic failure. Um, I have had my share of, uh, of good uh, successes along the way. And uh, one of the things that there was uh, John C. Maxwell was talking about uh, in this little section was to uh, maintain a teachable attitude in everything you do, right? Today and, and every day. And that is the key to failing forward. So if you follow these three tips, you will learn how to fail forward. Number one, take responsibility, right? Take responsibility for that failure. It's somebody else's fault. You're the one that failed, okay? And again, at some point, you're going to fail in your life. Accept that failure and keep moving forward. Don't let it discourage you, but understand, okay, this didn't work out. I failed. Let's do something else. Number two, learn the lesson. So what has this quote-unquote failure taught you, right? What is it trying to teach you? How does it apply? How does this lesson that you learned apply to the different areas of your life? One of the things I do uh, every morning is I write about something that's, um, you know, kind of bothering me or something that's triggering me, right? And one of the things that I always ask myself is, how is this this thing that happened, how is it positive, right? And then I extrapolate some lesson from this thing that, that happened, right? From this event, from this uh, thing that triggered me or that upset me. Then I take that lesson and I apply it to the different areas of my life, right? To my, my physical health, uh, my mental well-being, or my business, whatever it is. So I learn something from whatever issue I'm having at the moment. And that's what you need to do with this quote-unquote failure that you've had, right? 
What's the lesson, and how, do that, how does that lesson apply to different areas of my life? And number three, continue to take risks. Okay? Like I said before, the only way you're going to succeed is to move beyond your comfort zone. And there is a, um, a tendency for people to just give up after they've reached that first, you know, experienced that first failure. And I know, I've done it myself, right? I'm not pointing fingers at you and, you know, pretending that I'm perfect and I've never had, had any kind of failures. Because, you know, I have. So the thing is to not let this, you know, temporary failure, this setback, keep you from, you know, doing the things that you really want to do. And the only way you're going to get to that success Again, it's to get out of your comfort zone and continue to take risks. And that's the hardest part of dealing with any type of failure is to continue to move ahead and take more and bigger risks. So there you have it. That's how you fail forward. That's how you learn from your failures. That's how you turn them into positives. And that's how you are going to succeed. So... If you want to get your own copy of the Maxwell Daily Reader, I'll put a link in the uh, in the show notes in the description. Uh, you can pick one up uh, from Amazon, and uh, again, I highly uh, highly recommend it. And that's it. That is the end of this uh, podcast episode. Thanks for listening, and um, see you again real soon. <laughs>